for my heel elevated squats. One of the most important areas to have solid range of motion when doing your squats is your ankles to make sure that we can get deep enough. For some people, they have adequate range of motion in their ankles and they can get thick, nice and deep. For some people, they can't. Regardless of whether you do or don't, you can always use a little extra range of motion as we elevate the heels to get some nice deep stretch through our hip muscles and hopefully help them to grow a little stronger in that bottom position of the squat. With my heels being elevated, we have a couple options. We can put our heels on plates or we can use dumbbells to prop them up. There's also a special sponge that you can buy on Amazon that allows you to do the exact same thing. For here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna demo with dumbbells where I have 15 pound dumbbells. You can use 10s, you can use 7s, but you do want about a two to three inch elevation in those back heels. And then you're gonna notice as I go into my squat, I'm getting down nice and deep as my ankles are out of play. And then from here, I'm gonna drive up nice and strong. Nice and deep into that squat, right down to the bottom and drive up nice and strong. The biggest thing if you don't have enough ankle range of motion in your squat is that you'll start to round at the base of your squat. So when we do elevate the heels, we want to try and take that rounding out. So just make sure that as you're lowering, you don't feel any type of round in the bottom of your back and that you're able to stay nice and upright as you perform that exercise.